hello, 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 everyone. So I am so excited because I have a Monster High doll to unbox today. It is Miss Twyla. She has a purple and like teal green color scheme. She comes with a, a little sleep mask, a little, uh, looks like a little coffee drink maybe. A little sleeping bag, a dust bunny, a phone, a barrette, a little toaster strudel, and it also comes with a book. Um, I'm very excited to open it. I love the artwork on the back. I think it's very cool. Uh, it shows her and her friends having a sleepover. She's getting a little selfie over here while the girls are talking over here. I remember sleepovers were always so much fun as a kid. Uh, so I'm extra excited for this. So we're going to unbox her. We're going to get a good look at the doll. Um, and I really hope you enjoy it. Um, I got a second camera, so we're going to do something a little different today. Um, we are going to uh, use the second camera in uh, this unboxing and I set it up in a really cool way. Let me know if you like it or prefer it this way, uh, but we're going to switch to the second camera. Bye everyone. Okay, so we are at the um, second camera. It's looking good and we have Miss Twyla's pet. It is indeed a dust bunny. It is super cute. It's got like the cutest blue eyes. It's, it's, it's cute. It's cute. Um, she has this uh, book. It's got like teal in like a purple bluey color. And it's this intro to Tasmanes. I'm not sure what that is, but I think the book is cute. So I put that on the little desk right here. Twyla has a little phone, which I will show you next. It has little rabbit ears. I love rabbits and guinea pigs and everything like that. And so I love the phone and it has all the latest apps. Um, just to give you guys a close up. Okay, so next we have Twyla. Um, here is Miss Twyla. She has, like, tealy eyes, purple hair. She's wearing this, like, bunny hood, but it can be pulled off. Um, and she's so cute. I love her face sculpt. She's got these purple earrings and this purple bracelet. Um, the earrings kind of look like bugs, to be honest. Like, I, I feel like they look like ladybugs. She's got this black bow, this teal belt. The belt is adorable. Now, I did notice mine, her hands are like a different color purple to like some of her body. But she does have these uh, like accent colors, um, like tattoos on her legs that kind of look like the same color as her hands. Um, but I would have preferred if the hand was the same color as her arm color. I just feel like on this hand, I don't notice it as much because the purple bracelet kind of goes over the wrist and you can't really, you know, you can't tell if it like might be an ombre or something. But then on this hand, you can really, really tell and it's just very jarring. Um, now, she's got this little floof here, I'm going to call it. It's a floof um, and it's got like spider webs and it's at the bottom of her skirt. Um, so if you, zo if you zoom on out, oh, there we go, here where I go dropping things, um, she is so cute against the backdrop, she like almost blends right into the Monster High dollhouse, um, she looks super cute, she has these fun purple shoes, uh, they're really cute, they're like black wedged shoes. Um, and like I said, she's got the cool tattoos on the wrist. Um, but yeah, I really like her. Um, I think the uh, sleep mask is a fun detail, and I will attempt to put it on her. 
Um, I don't really know, like, how it's supposed to go on her with, like, the babies that she has. I'm like, I'm gonna mess her hair up trying to do this. Oh, goodness. Um, okay, so the sweet mask. Um, it, it looks a little odd on her. I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be real honest. Um, it, you can't really, like, trying to get it, like, just over her eyes and nose. Uh, but to me, it looks really odd. Um, I might not have her wear the sweet mask, even though I love bunnies. And I, I kind of wish the sleep mask was, like, fuzzy. I kind of wish the sleep mask was, like, fuzzy. I love the, like, pink and purple in her dress, though. I think everything about her is just really, really pretty. I'm just not a fan of the mask with the bangs that she has. Um, she has this little purple backpack with little blue eyes, and it's got a pink nose, and you can indeed. Sorry, I'm trying, I'm not used to this camera angle, so I'm, I'm trying not to like, um, like, like move the doll so you just like, in like a weird angle or anything. Um, but the, the bag, fits on her. I could picture getting like really pretty doll photography with this doll. Like look at that with like the bag and everything. Oh, something just blew. Uh, it did not hit my camera though. <laughs> Whatever it was did not hit my camera. Um, it did, did come down with a crash though. Woo, dangerous filming area Twyla. Twyla's like, what's going on over here? Um, I love her little little drink. You can kinda she can she can kinda hold her drink. You know, you can hold her legs, get her in like a like a pretty pose with her drink. I'm gonna put that on the table. She can't really hold her phone, I don't think. I mean actually she might be able to hold her phone. Um, let me try on this hand. Okay, she could totally hold her phone. That's cute. And then she has this barrette. I don't really know where we're supposed to put the barrette. Um, I guess I'm just gonna like... I mean, I don't know. Where did y'all wear barrettes as a kid? I... Like, I have no clue. Because, like, I don't feel like it looks nice like on her bangs but then I don't really know where else to put it um I think I'm just gonna put it on like this ponytail because under her hair she has this like little ponytail and you can kind of see the the like plastic tie so maybe I'll just like put it like I don't know right I just, I just don't know where to put it I honestly just don't know where to, to put it. I know where I like kind of want it to go, but I don't know if it'll look good there. Oh no, it looks it looks all right. I can put it right. I put it right. Kind of put it at the at the side of her ponytail. It doesn't really look that good where I put it, um, but it's on her. It's on her. Um, maybe if I kind of go like the other way. Yeah, 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 this rat here is gonna be like the death of me here. Um, yeah, I'm not, I'm not as big a fan of the barrette. I don't really know what I'm gonna do with it. Like, again, if you like to restyle the, her, your hair, and you were gonna take her hair out of her ponytail, it would probably look super, super nice, but I'm not going to. Now, her hair is a bit of, like, fox hair, kind of. It's, it was supposed to be curly. It's more like wavy and messy. Um, so she will need a bit of a hair restyle. Anyways, um, her hair is kind of crunchy on the bangs because she is, uh, she does have like some gel there. Uh, but um, yeah, she looks, she looks pretty cool. I am pretty pleased with my Twyla. And here is her little, um, 
our little uh, toaster strudel. Um, and once again, it's kind of the same thing as like the, the phone. You just can, uh, there's like a, a little hole and it, it, it usually like fits on the doll. Let me see if I can get it on. I might, I might be, be uh, wrong. Oh, no, yeah, it, 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 it's a little hole. You could just put it on her thumb um, and like take pictures that way. Um, but I just think the the amount of accessories you get is very, very nice. I'm sorry about that beeping. It is my uh, phone. My phone is just not liking me today. Um, but I like all the accessories that you get with Twyla. I feel like they're very, very nice. Um, I like her hair. I like her little ears. I don't know why this one's like folded down, but I kind of like it, so I'm not going to touch it. <laughs> I don't want to ruin it, because um, that seems to be like just her, her vibe and her aesthetic. Um, but let me know what you think about Twyla. Who do you picture Twyla being friends with? I could see Twyla and uh, Claudine getting along really well, just because they both have like this purple aesthetic with like a little bit of black uh, but I think she could get along with all the ghouls really well um, I am gonna see if I can pose um, my little my little Claudine next to her I kind of want to see like in comparison to Claudine how tall she is um, so let's, let's move her chair she is a tad shorter than Claudine and she was in Gen 1 as well this is we're on like the, the third of reboot it's like Gen 3 but uh or, or second reboot maybe um but uh yeah she is short I'm not sure if she's the same height as her original version like her Gen 1 version um but uh yeah, she's just, she's just slightly shorter. She's not actually even that much shorter. Um, I feel like Twyla looks like a little older than she did in the other series, but maybe that's because all the other dolls look younger to me. Um, yeah, she's super cute. Um, I do, I do like that we have, uh, Claudine in the, the backdrop. Um, I guess we'll get my little my little Halloween backdrop kind of set. Um, we'll uh, we'll put maybe Laguna across from her because I do like to change out the dolls that I have, um, and I definitely think I oh 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 I think Twyla should go this way. Um with her little, little toaster strudel friend. Um, I definitely think that is such a cute look for the dolls. I adore it. Maybe I'll even bring out Cleo. Cleo can be hanging with her friends. Um, oh, oh, Cleo's bag is just knocking things down. What did we even knock down? Twyla's drink, of course, for Twyla. There we go. You got your drink back, Twyla. These girls with these purses and these bags, they just be knocking everyone out. Um, but, uh, yeah. I feel like Cleo would kind of have a little, a little sassy pose. Like, like she's dishing the gossip. Um, you can't really see her. Maybe I'll, uh, maybe I'll move Twyla over a little. I like that. I think that's that's super cute. Um, and I, I think they they do work well. I have one of um, MGA's mini verses here. You could use that as like a drink for them, or you could use the Shopkins. I think the Shopkins is a good size, and they have faces on them similar to how the Monster High snacks do. Um, so to me, they look like they could be food from the Monster High, um, 
catalog, so we'll put this over here for Laguna. Because I know when I had a sleepover, girl, let me tell you, it was all about watching TV, uh, about fashion, food, and just fun. Like, you wanted to like be all fashionable with your friends, try on dresses and, and, and whatnot. Um, like, it was a big, big thing when I was younger, uh, sleepovers. Um, like, I had a few. I had a few, like, really fun sleepovers. Um, as a kid. Okay, I feel like I have two Rainbow High Makeup brushes, and I feel like I feel like I might put this one over here, maybe Laguna's drinking it. I mean, Twyla's kind of hogging the table. So Laguna gets a big drink, um, but I can't, I don't understand. I have this like little mini brand stock thing with like little miniature food and stuff. Um, I am, I think, I think, because this has storage in it, and I think when I moved it, I put, woo, me taking apart the background. Um, I think I put like the brushes and stuff in here, the rainbow high brushes. But uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna reset up our background. Um, I don't know if I was a kid, I would be over here like checking out the, my my friends' toys, playing with their toys, you know, getting into all kinds of trouble. My mom would be like, "Why are you playing with somebody else's toys? Let it broke it." I'd be like, Shh, "I never break nothing." never broke nothing in my life, you know, kind of thing. Um, yeah, I always had so much fun with sleepovers. I usually had sleepovers at uh, my Mama Jen's for a while in middle school. We called her Mama Jen's. She was like um, the mother of a friend of mine. And I had so much fun. We'd try on makeup and clothes. And I could just picture Twyla doing that. Uh, with the other uh, Monster High uh, girls and that kind of being um, something that they enjoy and look forward to. I would love to know your favorite sleepover memory. Let me know if you like this setup of like switching to the dollhouse and seeing the dolls that way and going through the accessories because then you can get a little bit of a close up and it has like a nice setting. Maybe we can open some mini brands over here um, one day. And uh, yeah, I'll see you all tomorrow. Bye, everyone.